Adding audio content to your website can be a great way to give your site personality, to engage the visitor, and to effectively communicate your sales message if used in that way. It can also be a great way to break up large volumes of content or, or textual copy. But let's see just how easy it is to insert audio content using the new Excite Pro 2. Here we have Excite Pro. Uh, what we're gonna do is we just, you can see this is the page layout, uh, a template that we're just gonna use for this demonstration. If I head over here to the web pages tab, uh, you'll see that we've put together a very quick, simple sales letter just to demonstrate how easy it is to insert audio into a, a sales page, for example. And where I want the audio to appear in this little white space here, I'm going to right click with my mouse and from the menu that appears, I'm going to select insert audio video and then the streaming audio option. Now that loads a simple four step audio wizard, the first step of which is asking us to select the input audio file, the file that we would like Excite Pro to use for this audio playback feature. So I'm going to browse my hard drive and select an audio file. Excite Pro takes a whole bunch of audio input formats. Then we click the next button to advance to step two. Step two saying, okay, what quality do you want that audio to play back at? I'm gonna select high quality because it's a sales message. I want it to be nice and clear. And then I'm gonna click next. Third step is saying, do you want the audio to play automatically when somebody first lands on the web page, Or do you want it to be down to the visitor to determine whether or not the audio plays? Out of courtesy, I'm gonna leave it to the visitor to decide. So I'm gonna click next. And then this final fourth step is saying, which playback controls do you want to use? I'm gonna use these nice blue ones on the right hand side and click generate. Once the uh, generation has finished, you'll see there's a placeholder, which we could right click to go back in and change uh, the properties of this audio feature, but I'm happy with them as they are. So I'm gonna click the preview button. Now previewing our website, of course, shows us what the site looks like before we publish it. And we can see here in our preview, if I just scroll down, sure enough, here is the audio playback control set. If I just press the play button, what I'm about to tell you in the next 60 seconds is gonna change your life. You may actually be able to hear um, that the audio is of course playing back in my browser, streaming it perfectly. So to round off, very simple to use, very powerful feature, and it can really add something to your web page content. I hope you enjoy putting it to good use.